So I'm going to start with my eyes and I'm using Jackie Ina's palette. Um, and so I learned this technique because I have hooded eyes and uh, we'll see how it works. Because as you guys know, this is not my forte. I am doing this um, because I like makeup and I'm trying to learn how to do it. So um, I learned this technique of going across instead of up and down because my eyes just are super hooded. But first, I need to put on concealer. So I'm going to use... First, I'm going to use my Fenty Beauty Concealer. Uh, I don't think it matters what shade it is at this point. But I'm going to use concealer to no. get the best Stop. out of my Ow. eyes. As you can hear, my son is in the background because that's mom life. And that's what moms do with the task. All right, I'm going to blend that out on my eyes. If you do want to know what shade it was, it's 450. You see, it's got like all over the place. <laughs> Guys, I'm not a makeup guru. This is not the point of the video, okay? It is for y'all to enjoy <laughs> me being really me, right? Um, and not knowing how the hell to put on makeup because there's like so many things. Okay, so the first step is, as I told y'all, I'm using Jackie Ina's palette. Jackie, 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 Jackie. Um, if you don't know who she is, you're probably living under a rock because everybody knows who Jackie Ina is. Um... But she is a, I believe she's Nigerian American YouTuber. And she does makeup and she's been doing it for like a really long time. Um, I used to watch her videos and then like I was just like, oh, I'm not gonna do anything. And now here I like to watch her videos like all the time now. So the technique I learned from some dude, I don't know, on YouTube. Um, but basically like starting with a lighter color in the front and then you move it out, smoke it out to the, you know, whatever. All right. So we're going to try it and we're going to see how this works. So I'm going to use my favorite color is Zam, but that be all over the place. Lituation is also pretty bomb. So lay... I believe that's how you say it. Soleil is also a great color. So, um, I don't know what to choose. I think I'm gonna go with, because I don't know what I'm doing. We're gonna just go with, also sponsors bomb. Okay, let's start with Soleil. And sometimes I actually use my finger to do this because I heard that's a good idea. So. Oh, it's coming, it's going, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. It's cute or whatever, you know, we out here. 
with hooded eyes, trying to do our best out here, living our best life. And I, I guess he said, go to your orbital bone. I don't know. So that's where I'm going up to. And then here's the next one on this side. The other thing that drives me crazy is that I cannot ever get them symmetrical. Like one side always looks better than the other. And I don't know if that's normal for like Jackie is becoming all nice. I also watch too much mouth a lot. I don't know if I can see, but this is so late that I'm using in my eyes. Just trying to like pat it on there. Attach letter, because he also said it's best to just like pat it on there and not like spread. And obviously these are shimmers, so you probably don't want to be patting or swiping all over the eye. And just a reminder, I am not a makeup guru. I'm just out here being a mom, trying to do makeup. So I'm not telling y'all how to do this. I'm just saying, this is what I learned. Okay. So I think we're good on that color. And I'm using BH Cosmetics brushes. We're supposed to tell brushes. This is number seven. I don't know what collection this is from, but it came in this little thingy and I got it from Ulta. So if you wanna know about brushes, there you go. All right, so I think I'm supposed to go out to the outer corner and do a dark color. So we're gonna use this color right here is called Credit. It's like a dark, 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 dark brown. So I'm using the same brush because it's just easier for me to do. So Credit is going to go. Oh, oh, I see you, Credit. Um, it's just going to go in the outer corners. And if you can see that, it's just out here, living its best life. Um, on the outer V, and I try to go up to my orbital one, like you said. I'm probably going too high. But basically, I'm creating a gradient. If you can't see it, I don't have great lighting, like, you know too much mouth in them but hopefully at the end or in the thumbnail you can actually see it but i'm just you know as i stated and you can hear also my son again in the background he got closer to me because his love language is touch just like his mommy so he has to be close to mama so I hope you guys can hear me. All right, on the other eye. Is, I think that went too high, but I can probably just wipe that down. You know, like I said, I'm not a makeup guru. I'm just, you know living my best life you guys can critique me all you want to i don't mind because i'm just learning especially with this see like you see how this eye this eye cooperated with this eye i look like spot you know like spot the dog that's what i look like right now on this side but pretty sure I can make this work. Pat, 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 pat. And I could just leave it here, you know? But I'm not. So. <laughs> so. 
see that right there. We're gonna take it off there at the top, but not now in a little bit. See this one like it's like oh you cute and the other one's like girl who likes your eyes? Not cute. Lastly, I'm gonna use I think this is I probably shouldn't use that one. I think I'm gonna use this is Eco Tools brush double sided and I'm gonna use the shade side and I'm gonna put either ginger or edges ginger is this color right here edges is that color right there um let's see let me let me swatch let me swatch it okay we're gonna do ginger and i'm gonna put that because apparently you're supposed to like Put a lighter color in the middle to like kind of give more transition or whatever. So your girl is putting I'm patting. Oh, oh, she cute too. What did I just use? Ginger. <laughs> putting ginger. Right, right there. Slamming doors. That's what happens in house. All right, other side. And I'm not putting a lot of ginger. But if you can see, you know, it's there. It's, it's cute. It's just chilling, you know. So, putting ginger. I should probably have one of those mirrors and stuff. Also, I watched Melissa and Deandra De Giselle. Deandra Giselle, they did had a channel called Two Brown Girls. And I used to watch them too. They were also makeup inspirations. But they no longer have that channel and I'm sad. Um, but I know Melissa's busy. And I think Deandra got busy. She also had a baby. And so like, you know, life changes. So you gotta go with the flow. But you know, it's nice to have people that look like you showing you makeup things. And all obviously I'm making this up because a lot of times I follow other people's, um, I'm just going in with more ginger. But a lot of times I, saw, I follow other people's makeup routines but what I noticed is because I have hooded eyes, I can't really be following them like that. So. All right, there we go. So it don't really be blended out like that, but if you can see what I could see, I'm gonna just hold it up for y'all to see. See, and also my husband's here. All right, so that's what you get. And I'm going to wipe this off at the top because too much girl did too much and swipe it off on top I know this probably is not what you're supposed to do but it, it's helpful for me um, see it don't look Okay, so what I'm thinking is that it needs to be blended somehow, but I'm not really sure how to blend sideways. Um, <laughs> I didn't really talk about that in the video. 
Um, so we're gonna try to like blow this out some. I think that's the right word. But obviously because I'm right-handed, I think my right eye is gonna look better just because of the nature of my eyes. And then I think I'm going, I mean, it's cute though. It don't look too bad. And then in the inner corner, I think, see like, you know that, I don't like that part either, but whatever. I'm gonna put Zwalla's, Zwalla's in my inner corner. I haven't done any, um, Ooh, ooh. Um, is this a good inner corner color? I mean, it could be. It just needs to be. Um, it needs to go up more into. Um, see, like Zam and Zola's are like super duper uh I don't know the word um whatever they a lot they look real glittery so there's a lot of fallout and I don't know how to contain fallout yet but we gonna figure it out out here in these streets. We gonna, we gonna figure it out in these streets. I feel like I need to get rid of a little bit more up here. Cause like this part like, looks good. So we don't um I'm gonna get rid of a little bit more in this inner part. And um, then we go um, I guess. fix that up a little bit see this is why they don't be symmetrical but it's cool like it don't look crazy or nothing all right so i don't have any foundation or nothing on yet but um i just recently so i've been using a foundation stick mostly for my foundation but i did prime my face and i used so I'm testing this out because as okay y'all don't know but I have allergies so when I got like I'm just testing this out but it's the milk hydro grip primer and it's super like it does what it's supposed to do so I like it so far but I also watch your girl too much mouth I'm shouting out all these people because this is where I learn stuff at and she does her what's it call it concealer before she does her actual um foundation so but also i'm gonna color correct because i have a faux stash because i went to get this wax and you know you see the brows um a week ago and I don't actually have a have a stash. It just kind of looks like I do. Unfortunately. So um I can't find my other concealer. So um but first I'm a color correct. I'll be distracted. I'll be distracted, yeah. Okay. It's gonna be a long video because I'm not organized. Like they seem super organized. They didn't have kids in the background, stuff like that. 
All right, so I'm using this NYX professional thing. It's all right. It's not what I thought it was going to be, but it is what it is. So I'm just using this obviously orange shade to color correct my mouth because it's a hot mess out here. You know, I don't think makeup videos are just long. Just mine, because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. And that's okay, guys. It's okay. And I could get better lighting, but you know. <laughs> it's hard out here for a pimp. Okay. Plus, like, what are y'all doing? What are y'all actually doing? Okay, I know the quarantine is, like, low-key gone, because... I live in Washington and so you know they opening stuff up we live by Ross the line for Ross is crazy like people are standing out the door waiting waiting to go inside it's actually quite crazy and I'm like I get it though Ross is the store like if you ever thought a store was a, wasn't a store Ross is that store Oh, these, this beauty blender is from Beauty Bakery, also black owned. Shout out to black owned businesses. Obviously, this is a collab with Jackie Ina and Anastasia Beverly Hills. I use Fenty. We know Fenty. We know Riri. We know. So yeah, the sponge is from, from Beauty Bakery. And I feel like I need more, but whatever. Okay, so I'm gonna leave that there. I'm gonna look a little orange for a minute. Um, so I'm using the Hydrating Camel Concealer in Rich Chocolate. This one isn't that light, but it gets what I need to get done. Ooh, ooh, wait, is this the right color? I feel like it's too dark. Hold up other color I have is rich ebony so I think I need to go up with the concealer shade but we but I don't know if I like super light highlights like some people will be like like Jackie who I'd be like dang Jackie but um I don't really like you know super light highlights ooh, ooh, look at that look at that uh, um but this line needs to too dark. Again, feel free to critique. Oh, like, be sweet and stuff, though. Don't be crazy in the comments. But, you know, feel free to say what you need to say in the comments about my makeup. Because, again, I am not a guru. I'm just out here trying to live my life and be cute. <clears throat> All right, so... Put on concealer you're supposed to let it dry down apparently and so that's what i'm you know that's what i'm letting happen wave it 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 um so i'm letting this dry down i blend my concealer and it be coming off because again i don't let it i wasn't letting it dry and so it was coming off so I'm about to learn or not learn i'm about to you know do better. i do better sometimes but i mean i posted some makeup pictures and i've you know i'm doing better out here so first i'm gonna start up here obviously and then work my way down my nose pat 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 but honestly i don't like super super light highlights they like i'm like do i like that i don't really like it okay so we're gonna let this dry down a little more because it's not it's not uh yeah um 
I have like three, I have four eyeshadow palettes. I'm tripping. I have four eyeshadow palettes. So, yeah, you see this? Super liquidy. That's why they be having them fans. Okay, we're gonna go on this side because this one is dry, probably because I rubbed it more. All right, so what I was, what I did learn though, is you're supposed to be like pat, pat, pat. And if you want your face to look more narrow, you go up more. To be more narrow, which you know, your girl is thick, so she would be wanting to look narrow. Okay? And so, I mean, honestly, though, I'm working out and it's bomb. I haven't lost pounds, but if you see my before and afters, check out Neek Fit Journey 7 on Instagram and you'll see, you know, those results. And now I'm on the second second round, I guess, uh, with Mossy and um, yeah, second round with Mossy Arius. Um, I think that's how you say it. I'm sure I'm saying it wrong because I'm American. Um, but yes, Mossy. Shout out to Mossy because it's been super helpful um, for me. Um, I also did my eyebrows already because I was trying to do a different video and it didn't work out. So I did use the minted uh, eyebrow pencil. I don't know what the color shade is, but I did do something to them. I don't do the carve out thing. That's just not my like zhuzh. I'm not like precise enough. And I just, I don't know if I really like that. Like, I think that's the great thing about makeup is that you can do whatever the hell you want however you want see okay so the difference is that this is clearly like whoo and this is like pretty chill this is the chill side but whatever we're gonna keep going so the next thing i'm going to use is nars sheer glow conceal i mean foundation and no it's not sheer glow is it it is sheer glow i just bought this uh not that long ago so i don't know why it doesn't have a pump that's ridiculous to me because i paid a lot of money for this um i was gonna get the other one but i was like just get this one. Oh, and the shade is new caledonia um I definitely cannot do okay I think I did this wrong too but we don't press it in our skin um I tried Macau and I was like girl this is not for you like this is not for you <laughs> I look like a dang ghost so there you have it um but this is my firm foundation hey all right we're gonna do better on this part you know put some on our nose obviously i don't know how many pumps i'm using because i don't have a pumper right so you don't know Am I even looking at y'all? I'm not good at this, y'all. The lighting, everything, you know. But it's cool. We gonna, we gonna be all right, 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 right. Um, all right. Press it in, press it in. And get that. You know what's crazy is that I didn't realize I had um, combination skin. I always thought I had dry skin. And then I started doing research on my life. And basically I have combo skin. And... 
I have combo skin because I figured it out because I get whiteheads right here and right here. And so I'm trying to, um, not trying to, but I want to get a facial to get rid of my whiteheads because whew, I hate those things. All right, next we're going to do, okay, so one thing that I struggle with is this powder, banana powder stuff and this deep medium powder stuff, like I don't understand. So I'll be using it, but I'll be confused with it because I was watching, I'll be watching Destiny I don't know her last name but destiny and i be watching jackie obviously i watch too much mouth i watch nama tang and i just be confused about like when do i put this powder on so whatever but we gonna contour just a little a little contour because you know sometimes you want to look a little snatch a ruse just a little though like not like crazy snatched but enough snatched and obviously I keep using the same beauty blender but I probably shouldn't but that's what we gonna do from what destiny was saying you're supposed to you know powder things like once you do this thing, you're supposed to powder this thing. And I'm like, I don't understand. Oh, what I was saying about, like, I be shining, like. And that's how also I knew I had oily skin. Because they would be like, oh, I be shiny, da, 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 da. And I'm like, what y'all talking about? And then I realized I have, you know, shiny skin. Like, up here especially, like, when the light be hitting it in my pictures, I be like... All right, you know, I don't know. I don't really like that Bridget. Like, let me tell you, I like, I like very simple makeup because I don't be liking to be, oh, my bad, y'all. <laughs> trying to move the camera. But I don't be liking like super, like, like my nose. I like my nose. Um, so I like the way it looks. So I don't be really pressed to like create the little bronze to look or whatever that you're supposed to have or whatever. All right, so I'm using, wait, did I tell y'all what I use? Oh, I use. Okay, so I used rich chocolate um, with the hydrating camel concealer from elf you know like some stuff i can use on my face that's cheap and some stuff i'm like nah like foundation we can't we can't do that we can't but concealer like it's cool whatever um now i'm about to do some powder and look your girl's working on this powder stuff okay so first we gonna I'm gonna start with this banana powder from Makeup Revolution. This is Banana Deep. And so I'm gonna use, this is a long video. <laughs> it's fine. So I'm gonna use BH Cosmetics number two brush. I don't really know uh, exactly what it's for, but I feel like I read it at the beginning. I don't have time to read it right now. So, um, but I just kind of, you know, dab it, dab it off and then place it underneath. And I know like this is supposed to help with like camera flashback also. The other reason why I want to do my makeup because, or figure out how to do my makeup is because I want to be able to like, so one of my goals 
is to be a writer but also a singer and do workshops speak at engagements all of the things a lot of the things so I want to be able to be like nah this is my shade because you know how they be doing us like they don't know how to necessarily do our makeup unless they have people in those spaces that actually look like us um and so I feel like it's important for me to know how to do it myself. Um, if you don't know, Adrienne Bailon does her own makeup. Her name is Houghton. Well, Bailon Houghton, you know what I'm saying. Um, she does her own makeup. So, and she has money to get an artist, but I think she actually likes doing it herself, so. Um, and I'm just setting, you know, my nose and so I don't really know if this is doing anything, but we um, um, I feel like my contour is not too like back out. So I'm just going to do my all over face powder. This is the medium deep loose setting powder from Minted and I'm going to just put a little bit in here as well you know whose makeup is always bomb Issa Rae her makeup is always bomb like also who likes Insecure and who's Team Molly because I just want y'all to know as much as people try to act like they don't like Molly that's probably because they have been Molly like who hasn't been able to say what they need in a relationship, whether with their family or with their friends or, you know, with, um, like in any relationship, like y'all think that y'all just got here and was like, yeah, we know how to speak to people like, no, no, y'all didn't stop playing. So I guess I'm saying that because I have been Molly and I'm still working on like being able to speak up and be like and I think they both aren't saying what they want in all honesty like it's not just on Molly it's not just on Issa it sucks because who hasn't sent a message like that before like dang I sent that to the wrong person and like I wasn't supposed to go to them you know like I think it's interesting for people to give so much like she's a toxic friend I'm like first of all like molly has been there for Issa. like think about that song she made about her like i don't know like dang girl like but she still didn't leave she was she was doing lift and she went with her on to that lift when the fight happened she was there like she's been down for Issa for a long time she cheated on lawrence and she was like girl like she's been there for her like this whole time and i think Molly just doesn't know how to be her friend anymore in the space that um, Issa's in now. She's a different person. She's not the same person. So I think that is really what it comes down to. So for all y'all Molly haters, y'all been Molly before. So don't play. Okay. Now that I got that off my chest. Um, I'm about to... This is a bronzing brush, but we're going to use it to put on blush and I'm not a big blush person but I feel like it adds like some something to your face so it doesn't look flat flat you know um and um yeah that's why I use blush and it's like a little bit, it's not a lot, it's just a little, little, little bit, because I don't like a lot of blush on my face, but, um, and this is also fermented, it is Buried Away Blush, and I want to get their, um, clay too much, because I feel like maybe that'll make me feel better, like, it's not, it depends on what it looks like, but, you know, when I smile, it looks, gives me more, like, definition, I'll bring the camera closer guys in a minute but because I'm pretty sure you can't see this because lighting 
All right, and then we go. My favorite thing to do, if I'm honest, is highlights. Highlights. Um, I like bronzing too. So this is a highlight and bronze palette. Oh, sorry, y'all. I'm see, I'm not good at this. Um, this is from the ABF, uh, minted in ABF. Ashley Blaine Featherson. I'm actually have not watched this show but it's called dear white people remember when people were like i'm not ever watching netflix again because you guys have a show called what is it i just said it dear white people and they probably should have watched that show because you know maybe this uprising wouldn't happen that's happening right now but whatever so <laughs> um i got the season two this this is not available any longer um but we don't have to use the same brush, you know, for actually, because I don't know where my highlighting brush is. So I'm gonna use one of these little brushes to highlight. Um, and yeah, highlighting is like my fave. But if I'm honest, I want to try a liquid highlighter because I think uh, it'll be better than a powder. Okay, so I have a highlighting brush and I don't know where it's at. So this is looking not what I want it to look like. Um, but let's let's use this and kind of you know spread that mess out but because i don't like my highlights like i'm like i said i like minimal but cute and you can see it so like you can kind of see this it looks fun um so basically i'm gonna just have to blend it out because see like on this side like it was popping it's popping it's popping it's popping all right i think the last thing i'm gonna do is obviously bronze because i really do like a good bronze and i don't know it just feels like it adds more warmth to my face and makes it look different by the way, I'm not going to be doing my hair in this video. It's going to stay like this. I might like tie it up. But I ain't going nowhere. So. Take me as I am or have nothing at all. Alright. Lastly. I think that's my son knocking on the door, y'all. And last but not least. A lip color. I don't really know what I want to do, but I think I'm gonna do. Okay, so as I've stated, I have a lot of minted products. So I think I'm actually gonna do a the uh what is this called? It's called Dark Knight. Dark Knight matte, and this is the pencil that goes with it. Sorry, guys, if that's bothering you, but my son just wants his mommy. All right, so that's the pencil. I probably shouldn't be using this as a mirror. <laughs> I'm gonna use this guys see you new to this stuff oh it's still it's good though it's cute um and then we go this is like almost almost gone see but i love their, their lipsticks this is the matte one and Bam. Mm. 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 All right. And 
there is my face. Okay, I'm going to let y'all see close up. So, here is the final look. See, highlight. Bam. What's up? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry, y'all saw my bed. Um, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. It's going to be crazy because obviously y'all heard a lot um, with my son in the background. But this is really just a video to like highlight that like I'm a makeup person that does not have the makeup thing together. But, you know, you can still make it be cute and make it work. So I'll probably post in more videos like this. Hopefully they won't be as long, but maybe I could talk about different subjects like insecure when it comes out on Sunday your girl will be talking to y'all about it and doing you know some makeup so we'll see all right thank y'all for watching bye oh girl I just want y'all to know that I forgot about doing anything to my eyes other than what I did that's probably why people don't do their eyes you know first but right now I'm done <laughs> so Next time I'll do liner and, you know, mascara. Maybe I'll do like a simple look with my minted palette and see what that looks like. All right. Bye, guys.